How do the Renans not know about this secret route of yours? Cisloden's an old city. It's littered with pathways that people have long forgotten. But keep your voice down. We don't know how long this route will stay hidden. Do you sense one of your friends, Hoodle? So this is Cisladen, capital city of Cislodia. Be careful. You never know where Snake Eyes or their informants are. ...lurking. We are basically walking into a Zoogle's den here. There are shops here? <laughs> on a permit basis. As long as people don't get reported on and sent to work the floodlights, economic activity is allowed here. All this talk about reports and permits. This place really is different from Calaglia.
Bagwell! Bragan! Shh! It's good to see you. Who's this? They're with me. If you say so. Come on, Menek's waiting. We can talk in there. The name's Menek, leader of the Silver Swords. And I wish I could extend my warmest welcome to you all, but... If my eyes don't deceive me, you appear to have a Renan in your midst. If she is your prisoner, that's a rather loose leash you have her on. She's not a prisoner. So why do I get the feeling there's a rat about the house? No offense intended. See, I've grown comfortable with the likely outcome I'll be stabbed in the back. But stabbed in the front? We risked our lives just to get here, sir. If you want to send her away, fine. But you'll lose me, too. I see. Trust is in about as short supply as light around these parts, and mine more than anyone's. But... I'll choose to believe you. Forgive my manners. You must be tired after such an arduous journey. But to business. We need your strength. The Snake Eye's grip on the city tightens by the day. Our people are suffocating out there. Hence the scouts I sent to find help. We're at the end of our tether here. That's why we're here. To help. We've got the firepower to do it, too. But first, we've got some urgent business to take care of. I see. So your leader is in need of rescuing. It's none of your concern. We get that. But... It's coming to our aid that got you into this mess in the first place. You can count on us. Just as long as you help us with our problem afterwards. If he's been arrested by the Snake Eyes, as you say, then there's a good chance he's being interrogated over at their headquarters. Either that, or he's being put to work over at the Floodlights. First priority is finding out where he is. If you're planning on tagging along, Rinwell will show you the way. Just make sure to keep a low profile. Remember, it's not just the Snake Eyes. Hostiles lurk among the villagers, too. This leader of yours, he must be quite the inspiration for you to go to such lengths for him. I look forward to meeting him someday. Let's head into town and see what the fuss is. Looks like we get to sleep with a roof over our heads. Have you and Menek known each other for long, Rinwell? No, not really. I haven't been with the Silver Swords for all that long, truth be told. He's a smart guy, but he's also deeply suspicious of other people. I can understand, since that's how you get to survive around here. Really? I could tell he was wary of us at first, but he seemed to warm up to us pretty quickly once we talked to him. Yeah, that's pretty unusual for him. I think that's a sign of how desperate things have become. In my case, it took a long time for him to start trusting me. But then again, I kind of get where he's coming from. You never know who might betray the group, or when the Snake Eyes might be watching. What made you join up with the Silver Swords in the first place? This wasn't your hometown, so... Was it the Snake Eyes who... No. It wasn't them. I just... Actually, we shouldn't stand around talking. People will start to suspect us. Let's keep moving. <laughs> <laughs> 